Okay. This video is to help people who get this message from YouTube. This video is unavailable on this device. So, to understand why this message occurs, in a minority of cases, it's because of some kind of copyright claim. Um, and in regards to that, the only thing you can do is to take the original file, re-edit it to take out the uh, copyrighted content, and then re-upload it. That's a minority of cases. That usually doesn't occur. In 90% of the time, it's because you've gone into the YouTube video editor and made an edit on your video. And after the edit had been complete, suddenly this message appears, it's unavailable on this device. So if we understand that, we can understand fundamentally how to correct it because it's a glitch in the video editing process of the YouTube video editor. So, um, there's two main solutions to this. The first one is to wait. In a minority of cases, waiting solves the problem. Uh, YouTube, the glitch resolves, basically, after a few hours. So, what I would have you do, number one, is wait for 24 hours and see if the message goes away and see if the video becomes accessible again. If that doesn't work, then number two, and this is what I did, this is what restored my video, you have to go into the YouTube video editor, all right, which is what you will have used to edit it originally, which brought up the message in the majority of cases, all right, and look at this button here, okay. Now you'll see one of the options is to revert the edit, revert to original. So this is going to reverse the edit that you made, which brought up the error. OK, so it'll basically reverse the process of editing, which glitched everything and fucked everything up. So you'll click that, a message will come up, this video is being processed, please check back later. It's the same thing that comes up if you do an edit originally. Um, and then it's just a case of waiting. Wait a good few hours, please be patient. I know you're pissed off, I was raging and, you know, throwing things, but wait, the video will process the edit will be reversed and hopefully, this worked for me, the video will become accessible again. So to go over that, two solutions. Number one is just to wait for 24 hours, see if the video becomes accessible again. If not, go into the video editor and revert to original and then see if that works.